Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel where it's my opinion or no opinion at all. Scott Alicious McFabulous here and I hope that you are feeling Percy. Give me my time. Give me, give me my time. And today we are headed to Coach Retail for the latest handbag drops featuring the Brooklyn Shoulder Bag 28 and 39, as well as the Empire Carry All 26 and 35. And to top it all off, we're going to look at the newest addition to the Tabby Shoulder Bag 33 with quilting. So without further ado, let us just hop right into this coach retail shop with me trip. Reveal yourself! Oh, oh. Oh. Yeah. Now y'all know exactly what time it is. It's time to get Percy at Coach Retail with some brand new handbag releases. And some old favorites. First up, we're going to be looking at the Brooklyn shoulder bags. These are some brand new ones. The natural green leather stamp on the bottom. I'm not sure how I feel about this natural grain leather. I'm not sure if it's full grain or top grain. I would prefer it to be full grain, but I honestly have no idea what natural means. I think that's just a fancy way of calling it some other type of leather. But I'm not horribly mad at it. It is a cute style. The inside does have like an unfinished leather on the inside. And it does feel a little dry. It feels dry, so I feel like that could crack over time. Which is a little unfortunate. But it is a gorgeous bag. I do like it. I do really like it. I think this color specifically just suits the style really nicely. Kind of has a very 2000s coach look. Get a closer look at the unfinished lining. Just to show what I mean. Adorable bag. And the green's really cute too. Has Coach embossed on the front there, Coach New York. And then next to it is the Brooklyn Shoulder Bag 39. The stamped tag there actually looked pretty good. It's a very large bag compared to the other size. The 28 and the 39 are pretty big, the difference is. $610 Canadian for the Brooklyn Shoulder Bag 39. I'll take a quick look at the other price tag in a moment. Has the tag embossed on the inner pouch. The Creed stamp, sorry. No feet on the bottom, but I feel like that's something I can kind of forgive. Kind of. The 28 is $360 Canadian. See, I feel like that's actually a pretty fair price for the, the 28. I feel like that's a really fair price. If you manage to get that on like a discount, I feel like that's like a no-brainer bag buy. You know what I mean? And the black one looks pretty good too. I think my favorite would be the sandy, the sandy color. Maybe the green though. I don't know. They're all really good looking. But next up goes to the Coach Empire Carry All 26. 
This one's in like a dark brown color. Unfortunately, prone to scratching. Brand new release and somebody has already given it a nasty mark. Has a mix of like leather trim at the top and then like a microfiber in the bottom. $550 Canadian. I don't feel like the gloved hand leather on this is horrible. Could be a little better, but again, I feel like I've beaten that horse enough recently. This isn't bad. A little pricey, but not horrible. And it does have the original gloved hand leather stamp on the bottom. I think my problem is with this bag in particular, it kind of looks like an outlet style. Doesn't look bad with my outfit. But here we got a size comparison in the black. The 39 versus the, oh, sorry. The 35 versus the 26. I personally would prefer the smaller size if I had to choose. A fairly large difference in size. Out of the two sizes, what is your favorite size? Kind of has some buckles on the inside so you can kind of cinch in the bag a little bit more. So that's nice. $790 Canadian though. Now that's not very nice. Go try this one on as well. Bam. Like I said, too big for my taste. <laughs> Got another color here, as well as the Heritage Bag Charms that I will be unboxing eventually. <laughs> we are two different ones. One has like the coach tag and the other has a coach key. This one also has like a flower. Both have the feathers. Black has silver and the hay color, whatever color they're calling it this time, is bronze. $90 Canadian plus tax. Actually not a bad price. Considering what you're getting, I don't feel like that's bad. In my opinion. And then here we're gonna look at the newer edition of the Tabby Shoulder Bag 33 with quilting. While looking at the older, the pewter one was made first. And in my opinion, we can kind of see how it's a little buttery, a little more buttery than the one beside it. Try to close it. And there's nothing in it, it is a little deflating. <laughs> This one has more of a matte soft finish where the other one has more of a supple buttery feel. I kind of prefer the pewter. It just feels like there's a more buttery effect. But I do kind of like that bronze gold hardware. I love the antique gold hardware.
$725 Canadian plus tax. Still hoping out one day I can get one of these. Preferably pewter, but gold wouldn't do bad either. This one, I think somebody stole the tag on this one. I hope they go to jail. <laughs> Alrighty, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video as it was, it's not a bad drop of bags. It's not bad. Could be better, but they're not bad. What are your thoughts and opinions? And without further ado, before we hop into my outfit of the day, and kitty delicious moment of the day if you guys love handbags hauls coach luxury the whole lot of those please hit the subscribe button if you are new and if you guys enjoyed today's content make sure you hit that like button as it does help me know you enjoy today's video and it helped with that pesky YouTube. Ow. Go. Rhythm. You can also check out the description box below for the three lucky links to my Instagram, Facebook, and Discord notification squad. As well, if you'd like to support me and the channel directly, you can always send me a very special super thanks donation. I love you all to the absolute moon and back. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye. I think it was good. I don't, I don't I'm done. I'm done. Oh, no. Show's <laughs> over. Show's over. See you next Taco Tuesday, bitch. <laughs>